Hello, I'm Matteo, the Chief Mobile Opinionist here at Tech Travel Geeks. And this is the Tech Travel Geeks how-to video where I'll walk you through how to enable or disable gesture navigation on the Nokia or Nokia G22. Now, as usual, um, depending on how you set up your smartphone, uh, there are different ways of navigating Android devices nowadays. You can usually choose between net gesture navigation, which allows you to switch between apps, move backwards and forwards through menus by using gestures, so swiping up and from the side of the device. And some people really want the old style of Android. So let's start off with uh, the first thing you should do. Obviously, you should subscribe to the Tech Travel Geeks here on YouTube and have that notification bell turned on so that you get the latest notifications and you can watch all our videos about consumer electronics, gadgets, accessories, and pretty much anything else we think makes the travel experience better. I'm just joking. You don't necessarily need to subscribe to us, but it would be much appreciated. Anyway, first things first, pull down from the notification and then pull down again. And then at the bottom right of the quick settings menu, you have the cog, press on that. And within your settings, it may, becomes really, really easy. You go to search and type in gesture. So that will essentially go and find gestures. And uh, these are the usual gestures. So gestures and then you've got system navigation under gestures and as you can see here this is as the Nokia G22 was set up for us or as we set it up in our previous video we went with for gesture navigation but if you prefer three button navigation you can press that and you can see that after about a second the Nokia G22 has the three buttons at the bottom so that makes it a permanent fixture on the smartphone you have the back button, the home button, and your multitasking button there. And that's how to turn gesture navigation off and get your three navigation buttons there. On the other hand, if you'd like to turn gesture navigation on, it's as simple as going back into the settings. Within settings, search for gesture. And within that, you've got gestures system and then tap on there and system navigation, you can choose to go back to gesture navigation. So that's it. It's uh, pretty simple. By default, Nokia do not offer the option to reorganize your buttons at the bottom uh, and have maybe the back button on the right hand side. Other smartphones such as Honor and Xiaomi and pretty much any other brand apart from Google uh, give you that option, but no kiddo. Anyway, we hope you've really found this video useful. And as I said earlier, if you don't already, please do subscribe to the Tech Travel Geeks here on YouTube, as well as how-to videos for devices we're covering and doing long-term reviews of, such as the Nokia G22. Um, we cover any consumer electronics, gadgets, or accessories we think make the travel experience better. And if you made it this far into the short video, thanks for watching. 